Hello Gemini, welcome to your bonus reading for Lionsgate Portal, August 8th, 2021. Thanks for joining me, my name is Michelle and this is for sun signs. can also be some rising peeking in here as well, but mainly uh, I'm picking up sun sign energy around this. Now Lionsgate, what is that? Well it is August 8th, 8 8 a very powerful spiritual number infinity symbols so I do feel that uh, whatever it is that you're trying to manifest around this new moon which is coinciding with Lionsgate portal this month is going to be something that has a great potential for success in your life here Gemini so let's see what I'm going to be doing here is I'm going to be doing my secret confessions reading so I'm keying into an energy of a person that isn't in your energetic field for the time period around August 8th, a few days either side as well. For Gemini, please, let's get the intention of this person uh, towards Gemini. We'll get whatever their focus may be. What's hidden? Their true thoughts and feelings about you, Gemini. Your true thoughts and feelings about them. The positives of this connection. The uh, challenge that you may face around the Lionsgate portal. Advice for you, Gemini. And the potential outcome. So let's take a look here for Gemini. What I want to do first is pull some cards specifically for you, uh, Gemini. So these, uh, I'm going to pull some tea leaves actually. So let's pull some tea leaves for you, Gemini. This is specifically your energy uh, for Gemini Sun Sign around the Lionsgate portal. Message for the air sign of Gemini, please, Spirit. I'm going to pull three cards. Okay, let's see. All right, so Gemini, you seem to have a, a secret admirer being highly thought of. I also get birth or conception of a child or enterprise, so a very uh, uh, empress-like energy around that. Okay, let's see where that goes, guys. I'm going to pull a uh, secret confession card. And this is a secret confession from the person that is on your mind here for Lionsgate. Secret confession from this person that Gemini is thinking of, Spirit. Okay, I feel it's this one here. Okay, as much as I'm into you, I wasn't expecting you to come into my life right now. I thought I had it all figured out. I thought I could spread my wings and stay single, unattached and free. I'm afraid to let you walk away, but I'm also afraid to let you love me right now. Okay, so wanting it a bit both ways here, uh, it appears. So let's see. All right, we do have the the Six of Swords in reverse. So yes, it does seem like uh, there's a lack. Things are bogged down at the moment. I feel like uh, this is someone who is content to watch from a distance. Uh, Gemini, okay. The Nine of Cups, but they're uh, very much focused on eventually, I, I feel, being with you, Gemini. I get a wish fulfillment, but I, I pick it up as future energy. This person is trying to get their life together, I do feel, with this Emperor card. Uh, I feel that they're trying to get... Uh, into a more stable position in life, taking control of their life. Uh, they're certainly not, not there yet. They're not ready for a relationship. Uh, they do want to, they do see the world with you, uh, Gemini. They do want to, uh, to experience the world with you. Uh, they feel that uh, the world is better because you are in it. I also get that. You're missing this person. I've got the Four of Cups here. I actually even get that you are emotionally trying not to attach to this individual. 
we've got the king of wands in the reverse okay and we also have the hanged man the desire is there but unfortunately I feel like this person is not making any moves at the present time again I get them watching from a distance okay we have the six of pentacles in reverse and the ten of swords in the reverse as your advice here Gemini yeah it, it really does feel like moving on at the present time moving on with your life going about your business I don't see you investing any time or effort into this because they are I feel like they you met this person they were into you and because it's not the right time I feel like they put you on the back burner they kept they're keeping you waiting uh, while they get their life together there may be physical distance between the two of you they may not be actually able to travel towards you at the moment and we have the four of wands in reverse with the nine of swords in reverse mm. yeah this person's not happy with where they are uh, they're not happy with their with where they're living they're not happy with their current life circumstances Gemini is what I'm getting uh, this is someone who has uh, yes sir uh, I do feel that they are very much have a crush on you they do indeed you know I want to get a card on that crib because that's interesting let me see can you clarify that crib energy around Gemini can you clarify the crib Queen of Wands okay Gemini I feel that that's how they see you very much admiring very attracted towards you uh, physically uh, they yeah they see you as their world they see you as the person that they want to be with but they're watching from the sidelines I get that they're not coming forward they're thinking a lot about you Gemini they are for some of you this is uh, I'm picking up this could be a cross watcher energy as well so if you're a, a fire sign cross watching for a Gemini uh, this may be uh, their energy as well I'm picking that up hmm interesting yeah this person is a content at the moment to watch you from the sidelines unfortunately though I feel that you have I feel that you, you've moved on from this I do there may even be someone else around you Gemini who I'm picking up as your counterpart this king of wands why it's coming up as a strength in the reverse is that I feel that this person is not coming towards you either so it seems like you have a couple of people here it feels like a bit of a race to the finish line from both of these people I feel that they're both interested in you they both want you but neither one is coming forward at the present time I feel if this king of wands was to step forward then this other person here would be out of the um, out of the loop so to speak hmm so it just depends on whether or not they're going to be able to get their their act together at the moment but uh, you, this person's definitely into you and I feel that they're thinking a lot about you around the Lionsgate portal and they're looking to see how they could possibly manifest this but I'm getting it as future energy this person is not actually physically doing anything about it around the Lionsgate portal okay so let's see I want to get this in it, person's energy towards you how they're feeling about you here Gemini how is this person feeling about Gemini how is this person feeling about Gemini please spirit okay they're inspired 
Yeah, you've stimulated them, you've challenged them they, to make a move in their life. To get to, you seem to be creating change in this person's life, inspiring them to create change in their life. Now, let's see, how are you feeling towards them? How is Gemini feeling towards this person? How is Gemini feeling towards them? Yeah, they may have been unhappy. Okay. Fulfilled came out in the reverse, so I feel that you're working on your own satisfaction. Uh, this is a card of being self-actualized, self-realized. So I feel that ultimately I get you working on yourself at the moment, Gemini. Working on becoming, working on fulfilling you, your own desires. Now, you seem to be uh, very focused on uh, your career. Yeah, very, I get very Nine of Pentacles energy off that, which is nice. And you're standing out to this person because of it. They're seeing you really working on your success and, and you are inspiring them to, to do the same. It's kind of like I see this person writing, writing, uh, writing songs about you, writing uh, poetry about you. You seem to have fired up their creativity. It's really beautiful energy, but the, unfortunately I, I see it as it's all a bit of a secret here at the moment. Let me read this again to you. As much as I'm into you, I wasn't expecting you to come into my life right now. I thought I had it all figured out. I thought I could spread my wings and stay single, unattached and free. I'm afraid to let you walk away, but I'm afraid to let you love me right now. So this person is distancing themselves because of that. Gemini, I'm going to leave it there and wish you all the very best. Remember, this is for a short time period around the Lionsgate portal, August 8th. If you'd like a personal reading, you can email me, gypsyinsights at gmail.com. Or you can go to my Etsy shop, the link is down below. And that's Gypsy Insights Tarot on Etsy. Wishing you the best here. Please do press that thumbs up button. Leave me a comment down below. Let me know what you're busy manifesting here around the Lion's Gate. And I will talk to you again very soon. Bye for now, Gemini.